Hello everyone, welcome to another video of Next Generation Mechanic. Today I'm going to check the magnetic chip detectors on a CFM 56-7B. The engine has an oil system to lubricate, cool and clean the engine bearings and gears. To monitor the wear and tear of components in the oil system on a set interval we check the engine magnetic chip detectors. The magnetic chip detectors collect and keep the unwanted materials from the scavenge oil. The magnetic chip detectors keeps all the ferrous and non-ferrous materials. Oil is stored in the oil tank. When the engine runs, the oil pump pressurizes the oil system. Oil goes through the anti-leakage valve through the oil pump to the engine oil users. The scavenge oil is collected and run through the scavenge side of the lubrication unit. Here it passes the magnetic chip detectors. Through the scavenge oil filter, through the oil fuel heat exchanger and back into the oil tank. When we open the engine fan cowl on the left hand side there's the lubrication unit. Here you can see the three magnetic chip detectors. With this special tool I remove the magnetic chip detectors by pushing it and then turning it. There's a chip detector for every three of the scavenge circuits. Those are the forward sump, rear sump, accessory gearbox and the transfer gearbox. As you can see there is a screen on the magnetic chip detector. This screen keeps the non-ferrous materials from the scavenge oil. Now I look globally if I don't see any big materials on the magnetic chip detector. I remove the screen and detail inspect if I see any big materials. After the screen I check the magnet to see if there are no magnetic particles collected on the chip detector's magnet. No ferrous nor non-ferrous materials were found. Inspect the D-seal for any obvious damage there's cracks, cuts or other damages, which could lead to a leak. I replace the seal the screen is put back on the magnetic chip detector and installed back into the lubrication unit. I do the same exact process with the other two magnetic chip detectors, but I'm not going to show you that. Thanks for watching and see you next time.